Green Best for Olive Green. My name is Eric Bess. I collaborate with my wife, Elin Bess. We're both artists. We've entered in the show. Vertigo, Skewed, Through the Fence, and Olive Green. Mixed media is uh, kind of exciting because you're not just blocked into, uh, if that's the word, blocked into one material. I myself have always tended to hop around from whether it be colored pencil onto pastel, onto tempera. Elin's been working on uh, mixed media for many years. So I've done everything from uh, oil painting to collage. And I believe all art tells a story, whether it actually has a line of copy to go with it. What started happening with these collaborative pieces several years ago is uh, they seem to imply it's a narrative art. Obviously, you look at it and your mind fills in a blank that's got a story with it. So we ended up incorporating, as it became part of just the product, a little storyline and it actually is sold with the piece. These pieces, Elan has been passionate about for several years, are called wisdom art for a reason. We both believe art should be an uplifting process. So there's actually a positive message of some sort that accompanies each of her uh, wisdom art pieces. Hi, my name is Wendy Roth, and um, I entered this painting um, into the Flagler County Art League uh, and the name of it is um, Bird on a Wire, and it won Best of Show. The theme of the painting is uh, really about um, change. Um, I paint feelings when I paint, and um, I paint feelings that I have, and I hope to convey those feelings to the people that are looking at my paintings, and I hope that they can identify with those feelings. At the time that I painted this, I was going through, I was at a crossroads in my life and making some decisions. And it was a scary time, but it was also full of potential and endless possibilities. And um, I think that the bird, um, I love crows and I identify with crows. You might say they're my, they've always been my totem. And so that crow is basically me hanging on a wire and I felt very tentative in that time in my life. And um, I think that um, that's what he feels. But he also sees the vast potential out there and where he can go. My name is uh, Emil Dillon II. Um, I entered my painting of Mel's Diner in Hollywood, California in the show, and it won second place of show. I went out to California last summer to photograph vintage movie theaters. When I got to Los Angeles, we have a friend who's an actress at uh, Warner Brothers Studios. So she took us to Hollywood and showed us around, and then she took us to Mel's Diner for lunch. And so while we were there, I liked the sign they had outside, so I shot about 100 photographs of it with the intention of making a painting, and here's the painting. We have a, an interesting place that we live in. It's actually a self-made gallery in a sense. So we turned our living place into an uh, expose of what we do, which is fairly exciting.